So hi guys, I'm out in Destiny at war again. So you guys know about the big blow up a couple of days ago. Where they're stranded in a hotel room in Florida because this producer refused to pay for the hotel room. So they're going to have to get out of there because they can't afford to be there any, any additional time. But before we get deeper into the video, can you guys just hit that like bell as you come onto the page as well as the subscribe button? Thank you. Now let's get back to the video. And I don't understand how Amari is going to go there broke and always depending on people to pay for hotel. You should be woman enough to pay for your own hotel and recoup the loss later on. In any event, she went with her daughter. She and her daughter are stranded. She called the cops and Destiny because Destiny, Goody sent her money to get back home to, to California, but she don't want to go back with Destiny. The cops came to the hotel room, and this is what Destiny is sitting down there saying to herself. She said she don't want to go to a shelter, and she don't want to go back home because Shawnee and uh, the other one, Nikki, are there with the kids. Everybody is back there. So Destiny wanted the place to herself with her mother so she can run the show and run circles around her mother. But now the two older girls are there. She's not going to be able to do that. So she don't want to go back to California. And she don't want to go to a shelter. She lost her job because she said she had two jobs. And because Amari forced her to come with her, she lost the job. So nobody's going to force her. She's 20. She could have said, no, I'm not going. But she loves being on the road with her mother and fighting with her mother. That's the problem. She got used to that. So now she's addicted to the fighting. That's why she went, I think. So I don't know what she's going to do, but this is what she said. She, this is what she said while she was sitting there contemplating what she's going to do. So the police is at a hotel at this point. Destiny's talking to them. They're talking to Amari. They're going back and forth. They're asking De Destiny questions and giving her solutions where she can go, all of which she turned down. Let's take a listen. Hello. This is ridiculous. What's ridiculous? What's going on right now? What's going on? It's my mom. Mom. No, it's not. We don't live here. I'm from California. What's going on? Oh, I'm not going back to California. Her, or she tell you blah 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 whatever. She's leaving me right now. She's going to the airport and I don't know where I'm going. No, I don't like my brother either. So they're asking her if she has a place to go. She says no. She They suggest her brother. She says, I don't like him either. So she doesn't like any, anyone in her family, period. I don't have cash out. Because I don't even have a phone. So she don't have a phone because Amari had thrown that phone and broke that phone. I guess that was the good phone because she is talking on a phone right now. I guess that's the backup phone. So when she says she don't have a phone, that's not true. She does have a phone, but maybe that's not a good one. She's leaving right now. I don't know if she, she going to, she going back to Cali. She's leaving right now. So she said she'd never want to stay with David. I think David is in a in a hotel, the hotel room in the next room because uh, there was a live, I think a, a day or so ago where he was coming out on his own side of the balcony. So he's in the hotel, but in a different part, a different room. These of fire are in. I'm, I don't want to live in no shelter. 
But Destiny needs to make up her mind where she want to go, honey. Because you don't want to be in a shelter. You don't want to be with David. You don't want to go back to Cali. Where the hell are you going to go? You have no money. You, you, you had two jobs in Cali and you, you went on the road and and I don't even I don't even know what kind of excuse she gives the people for being away from work. But trust and believe, you're not there in two days and you didn't call in, you don't have a job. This camera camera's broken. Everything is broken. So maybe that's the phone Amari threw earlier in the live and broke. So she does have a phone, but it's broken. So this song's that classic called Depression right now that Destiny is in. Depression 101. She feels she's between a rock and a hard place, no place to go, no money. And she is being left in a city by herself. So she's depressed. Ain't no money or nothing gonna do nothing. Money for what? what what's money gonna do? Go in a hotel and do what? Live there? So, Destiny said what money is going to do. Go in a hotel and live there? Well, ho honey, at least you'll have a place to stay. You'll have a roof over you. Because you, it, so, it looks like to me now that she just want to be with Amari to aggravate Amari. That's what it looks like to me. She don't want to go out on her own because she figures she's going to be aggravating her mother to death. So, maybe it's, it's good in a way that the two older girls, Shawnee and Nikki, are there because she can only go but so far. Because Amari don't have the good sense to give her the boot. Hopefully, this is it right here. And Amari would get on that plane without Destiny. And let Destiny decide what she want to do. Because we've seen this thing getting worse. Now Destiny is actually fighting with her mother. Her mother says something that she don't like. She goes right up in her face. She grabs the phone. She, you know, she'll tussle with her. And that's only the beginning, folks. When kids are like that, they will punch the heck out of you. One day, they will, you know, throw blows, okay? If she hasn't done so as yet, I don't know. So Destiny have to get her life together. Sounds right now that she's depressed, but um, instead of arguing with her mother constantly, because she wants to square up like a woman with Amari, you can't do that when you're under somebody's roof. Amari's got her faults, but Destiny's a child. She cannot square up against her mother one-on-one -on -one like this. And expect to still be under her roof. She gotta learn the hard way. I don't even care. What, what am I fighting for? Be honest. In California, all they do is use me. All I do is clean and cook. I don't do nothing in California. Sacramento is born. She cleans and cook because she wants to, because she don't want anybody else to do it. So Destiny got to take responsibility. She's 20 years old. She got to stop blaming and start taking accountability. What am I, what am I running back to Sacramento for? Everybody already took over the house. Everybody already had their families. Why am I fighting to be a part of something I never was a part of. Well, this is the problem. Destiny feels the house should be hers and hers alone. And maybe it's a good thing that those girls came back home because Destiny was running the show. Again, uh, Destiny fights with everybody. I mean, I'm calling a spade a spade. 
Amari is wrong in a lot of things that she do to Destiny and she cusses her out, but Destiny needs to think, take, she needs to take accountability at this point because she's 20. If she don't like it with her mother, she can leave. She had two jobs. She could have stayed in those two jobs and get her own place and not go on the road with her mother. As an adult, you got to make decisions independent of other people. You can't be up on your mother to the point where you leave two jobs and then you're going to blame your mother because you left the two jobs. So all this talking she's doing, she's she got her phone, talking to the phone. The cops are talking to Amari, and I'm sure they're looking at her like if she's a little wacko because she's not talking to the cops, and the cops are right there. She should be telling the cops about exactly what went down and, you know, take some alternatives of places she needs to go because if she don't want to go back to Cali, at least she can go somewhere. Why? You think you think my sister, brother, you think any of them care? They don't care. So there's no family regardless. songs right now what destiny needs is some therapy she's going through a moment you know she's going through some type of depression i hope she gets it all together So the cops asked her to come inside and she said, you, she, she, you know, dismissed him with her hands. And he said, you're going to sit on the staircase? And she said, yes. So what else can they do but leave? So he told her, well, the shelter's open if you want to go there. She said she's not going there. So he said, okay, take care. Good luck. What else can he do? So Destiny is really going through it right now. I see a young woman who is at a crossroad, a crossroads of her life. She don't know what to do, where to turn. She has no one in her corner. And all she can think about is talking on the internet. Well, talking on the internet is not the solution to what's happening right now. Right now she needs a place to go to because her mother is about to get on the plane and leave her. But we're going to see 
if Amari gets on that plane and leaves Destiny in Florida, we're going to see. And in the moment when things are moving for you, get up and take a plane to Fort Lauderdale. With Fort Kamar. Who made me lose my job? Who you spent? Who you who you spent from night to day? You were sitting there making up a whole rumor saying I sat with a, a married man. And then you wonder why all this happened. A whole, a whole day you spent saying that. And then now you want to say you're leaving me. So what? So what? So? So what? What is there to go home to? Huh? Hmm? I ain't shit to go home to anyway. So Maurice continuing to talk to the cops. This reminds me of the movie Beloved. You know that movie that Oprah made? You guys go check that movie out. This reminds me of that movie. So I'm going to check out some videos today and see if Amari left with Destiny or she left her back because this is a new day. We'll see. YouTubers, drop your comments. I'm over now. Don't forget to hit the like button before leaving the page and subscribe to the channel if you have not done so. I'm over and out. See you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching.